close to the triple digits. That is the reality for dozens of families at a Spring Branch apartment complex. Our Mar Maria Salazar is out there looking into what happened and how soon they might get the power back, Maria. Hi, Jonathan. That's right. I'm at Green Oak Village Apartments in Spring Branch on Blaylock, and I did speak to Centerpoint Energy. They confirmed that they some people here have been without power since Tuesday because they say they have to wait on the complex to make equipment repairs before they can restore power. Now, I'm just waiting here to go live. I was speaking to some people as they were walking by, and some of the residents here say that they are still without power and wondering how they're going to make it through another night if they have have to in this unbearable heat. This resident who did not want to use her name says this has been her reality since Tuesday night. No power, spoiled food, and trying to stay cool. She's not the only one. The moment I came inside my apartment, there was no light at all. Multiple buildings at Green Oak Village Apartments in Spring Branch are without power. Residents say they've scrambled to find family members to stay with. One resident reportedly slept outside in a hammock. Neighbors who do have power are allowing others to charge their phones. What I'm trying to do, trying to go get something to eat and charge my phone because later today I'm going to go to work and I, I don't have a car so I take the Uber. And I need my phone charged. Many residents were too afraid to talk on camera, saying this is just one of the latest problems with management. She has added to problems. Es que si uno está pagando la renta y está, eso es malo para los niños. This resident says they're fed up with paying rent only to have their request for service ignored, and she's worried about her kids. I waited to speak with the manager on the phone and at the door. There were people inside, but it wasn't until I walked away that I was told to get off the property and the woman refused to answer my questions. Later, Nova Asset Management did send a statement via email saying nine buildings lost power on Tuesday night and the power was restored the next day, adding quote. However, when Centerpoint turned on the power, their fuse blew away on the pole. Liberty Electrical is continuously and tirelessly working since 623-21 afternoon to restore power as soon as possible. And while I was out here, I did have several residents come up to me, make other complaints about the complex, such as broken appliances and other health and safety concerns about their living conditions. And I did reach out to the city of Houston, their permitting center on their um, habitability team said that they have only gotten two complaints against this apartment complex since last year. Both of them were electrical issues. And they say that they do understand that electrical contractors are out here today and uh, making these repairs and that permanent repairs will begin tomorrow. Reporting live in Spring Branch, Maria Salazar, Fox 26 News.